Hi all and welcome. We have the new Dash logo here. So we're at a time when a transition is happening. Also the Evolution wallets will be coming out later this year in 2018. But for the meantime, let's recover a Dash Electrum wallet. Now you can go to uh, the Dash site here and go to all wallets or you can simply go to electrum.dash.org. Make sure it's either one of these two sites. So we'll navigate from, uh, from the Dash site, dash.org, to all wallets. And scrolling down here, I'm, we're using the desktop wallet and I'm going to OSX for Macintosh and I'm going to download here. The download may take around a minute or so. So this is my seed right here, the precious seed. That is the private key basically to my Electrum wallet. This is all I need to recover the wallet and I saved this when I created the wallet the first time. But the scenario would be that my computer fell into the ocean and I can't get that computer back and that, had my, that computer had my wallet on it. Of course, this is just a, just a scenario, but so what we're going to do is uh, revive, restart this wallet using this seed. So on the Macintosh, it downloads into the downloads file on my computer, and when this icon comes up, you can double click on it, and then you have this icon and you can double click on this one also. Now you need to allow your computer to download this application from the internet. So I'm going to go to open right here. And I will just use default wallet, but you can rename this if you wish. So you, we'll, we'll put a one there. You can rename it one wallet. I now go to next. We are going to start up a standard wallet, so we'll leave it like so. There are options here, and we will go next. So now, this is the crucial part. Instead of crea uh, create a new seed, which would be creating a new wallet, I don't want to do that. I want to revive my old wallet. So I'm going to go here, where I already have a seed. This is the seed from my old wallet. So we will now go to next. So what I'm going to do now is type my old seed in. Now that I've typed my old seed into this new wallet, if you will, I will now go to next. Now, now it wants me to put, to put a, a password, password in, so you can put a new password in wish. if you wish. So I'll do, so that, I'll do right that right now. now. You put your password in twice and then go next. So what it has done now is brought up this wallet and within this wallet you can see that I do have a very small balance in here. So that is fantastic. I have revived my Dash Electrum wallet. So I hope you enjoyed this very short tutorial and stay dashy.